Hi guys, what's up? Spads here. Today we are reviewing the Axis Matte Black Dual Visor Full Face Eagle Shell Helmet. And we are also gonna wear this for a first ride so that we can check if all the bells and whistle of this helmet is actually functional. proceed to the review itself I just want to tell you that this helmet right here we are actually giving it away so if you're interested in that I have linked a video down in the description or anywhere in the screen right here that video contains the instructions on how to avail our giveaway so after this video make sure you head to that instructional video right there follow the instructions Avail the giveaway, okay, and wait for the announcement date and get a chance to win the helmet. Okay, guys? So let's go. Um, we are gonna be reviewing this what's the features and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna wear this for the first ride of the helmet we'll see the comfort what it can bring us sound suppression and at the same time kumabigat ba siya or if comfortable siya to wear for long ride okay so right off the bat we have the uh, dual visor uh, for the helmet as you can see right there a smoke visor inside and then a clear visor on the outside um, basic of the helmets we have the uh, ventilations in the front and at the top right here right there in the top ventilation and then we have ventilation in the front as well and the good thing about this is there's parang aerodynamics in the front so that it, the the air coming in dito siya lalabas sa may front ng helmet, as you can see, aakyat siya dito sa loob. Okay? If you have the second visor uh, down, uh, makikita nyo, yung aerodynamics siya is papunti dito. Right off the bat, as I can see, siguro mas mabisa if yung secondary visor niya, medyo, siguro pag binaba pa nila, para at least hanggang dito, mas okay siya. But that's just for me. Okay? And then, at the back, as you can see, right there, uh, there are holes at the back. So that airflow from the front will proceed and exit in the back. Okay, so we will check that out later if okay yung ventilation niya coming in from the front or from the top going to the back. Okay, so other thing that I've noticed about this helmet is that kung check nyo dito sa baba, meron siyang parang flat surface. Hindi katulad ng helmet na parang ganito lang. Uh, if you check right there, may siyang flat surface. That actually helps on stabilizing the helmet. Kung nilalagay nyo lang sa, siya, sa table, parang ganyan, it avoids falling it down kasi may parang platform siya sa baba. Ayan. I like that. Not a lot of helmets have that. So, thumbs up sa axis na ginawa nila ng ganyan. Other helmets don't have that. This one has it. It will prevent it from rolling. Okay? But not actually 100% prevent it. But it's handy sa mga helmet ng ganyan. Okay? We have the visor. We have the lock right there. We will check later sa ride natin if effective ba tong visor nila if it will prevent wind going in okay especially the wind noise yung lock niya if easy to use ba siya whenever you have gloves and you're on the road uh, if you just lift this uh, by one hand so to check natin yan mamaya sa ride okay so moving on and the second visor uh, we have the smoke visor right there dami ng <laughs> so, uh, hands ko okay we have the smoke visor as you can see and dit yung lock niya okay so ayan if it goes up, as you can see, parang may gap dyan. Kasi yung gagawin nyo, ipupush nyo yan, maglalak siya pataas. So, that will prevent accidental pulling down the visor when you have gloves. Because I know everyone hassle siya kapag may gloves ka to find these knobs on your helmet. At the same time, uh, if you pull it down as well, meron siyang lock. Yan, nag-click siya. So, if mag-pull ka ng second visor niya down, you'll have to do it all the way. Para marinig nyo yung lock niya. So that whenever you are using the second visor and then you're uh, going really fast, hindi aakit yung visor mo. But we will test that later on our first try if affected by yung lock nila. Let's take a look at the foam. 
okay these are the foam right off the bat i can see that the foam of this brand the axis brand is much more better than the other helmets that i have kasi makikita nyo may mga leather layer siya and then the foam layer unlike the foam layer that i have with my evo helmet yung ginagamit ko medyo manipis siya and then nakukuha yung ano yung <laughs> yung mga lock dito so eto makikita nyo talagang sturdy siya hindi siya basta-basta ang nakukuha. So, yung problema ko kasi sa Evo helmet ko, kapag sinusuot ko siya at tinatanggal, natatanggal din yung mga foam dito. So, uh, yung lock niya dito sa gilid, hindi masyadong nalalak yung helmet. So, eto, right off the bat, makikita nyo, sturdy siya. Okay? Yan. Yan, hindi siya masyadong makukuha. And at the same time, um, yung foam niya, medyo makapal kumpara sa Evo helmet ko. Okay? Well, that's just for me. Okay, so I'm not, I'm still using the Evo helmet. It's my first helmet. I mean, it's my go-to helmet whenever I ride. Okay, so uh, this one, uh, of course, we have the safety locks here. Basic yan sa mga helmet natin. At the same time, yung significant ng helmet na to is yung, um, ayan, may button siya na whenever you pull it out, makikita nyo, hinuhugasan nyo yung foam. So, there's a button there that you need to put. And then, eto, or double-sided tape to uh, help the foam from moving around whenever you're using the helmet, taking it off, putting it back on again. Uh, a little silver decals. So, don't forget, we're giving this away. So, uh, tara, labas tayo, wear natin to for our first side, and then we'll see what it looks like and how it performs on the road. Okay, so let's go. Okay guys, what's up? So, we're back on the road. As you can see, I'm wearing the helmet right now. <laughs> First off, when I put on the helmet, there's one thing that really strikes me about this helmet is yung fit ng foam niya sa face ko talaga. It does really lock in dito sa baba. And as I can tell, yung noise suppression niya is much better than the Evo helmet that I have. You know, the Valiant helmet that I have. So, ayan, good job on that. Okay, this is the first time that I wore the helmet. First time ko tong ma-feel yung ganitong comfort. Okay? So, the comfort level is really good. Maybe it's because the foam is much... Teka lang guys, overtake lang ako. The foam is much thicker than the uh, Evo helmet that I have. It's on par with the Ryu helmet that I first got nang bumili ako ng motor. When I say comfort, di siya masyadong masikip. Sakto lang yung mga foam sa loob. By sakto, I mean, di niya trigger yung mga pressure points ko sa loob. Right now, as I'm riding it, uh, I feel very comfortable with it. Uh, medyo maluwag lang siya kasi <laughs> large tong kinuha because I'm giving it away and di lahat nata siguro ng mga riders katulad ng, ano, ng size ng head ko. So, ayan. Yung noise suppression niya from the wind noise is actually really good. I don't know if you can hear uh, in the sound of the wind noise right now in the, mic the microphone. I was concerned about that earlier pero okay siya. So, foam with noise, comfort, ano pa ba? Yung weight ng helmet. Actually, okay siya. Um, hindi ko nakita kung ilang yung weight ng helmet na to. Maybe you guys can comment down below kung anong weight ng helmet na to. Pero, it's much more lighter than the Evo helmet that I have. Pareho sila ng kulay <laughs> ng motor ko. So, go to helmet ko yun. Uh, for me, I feel lighter uh, wearing this helmet. And at the same time, hindi nangangalay yung ano yung leg ko. So, okay siya. But we will know kasi so ilang minutes pa lang tayo nagra-ride. So, we will know uh, later if uh, hanggang saan yung comfort niya. So, we have that three uh, items that I really like in the helmet. Uh, the other thing that I like as well is yung buka ng helmet. Yung vision mo sa helmet is masyadong malaki. I can see my peripheral visions on the sides which is actually a good thing. Uh, yung, yung ibang helmet kasi medyo limited view mo sa side. As you can see guys, eto. Yung dual visor niya, medyo alanganin yung dual visor niya. When I say alanganin, medyo bitin. <laughs> uh, I would suggest that they push it further down because the problem is medyo may gap siya sa baba. As you can see, and 
Ay, yung problema nito is if I glance over sa ano, sa mga uh, uh, mirrors ko na ganyan, there's a separate vision <laughs> dun sa smoke lens and then dun sa clear lens. So, uh, that's a hazard when you're trying to glance on your uh, mirror. So, uh, that's one downside of this helmet. Pero naaamiss talaga ako ang comfortable ng helmet na to. Ang ganda ng, ng placements ng mga foam ng helmet. Yung inaasahan ko na magti-trigger ng pressure points is dito sa ano, sa mga sa ears ko banda. Pero yung helmet na to is wala. It's really tight on your neck. Pero pagdating dito sa baba, hindi siya kasi kep Oh well, in fact, siya ganun ka wobbly Nagwa-wobble yung helmet na ganyan uh, At the same time na hindi niya tinitrigger yung pressure points Because I know yung mga pressure points na yun um, In the long run, it's gonna create a riding fatigue Sa mga riders, okay? The same thing with sound suppression So, when I buy a helmet uh, Those are the things that I really look after for uh, Sound suppression, wind noise fatigue uh, Isa yun sa mga factors stress sa mga riders and at the same time yung comfort ng helmets especially yung pressure point triggers ng helmet wala na ako masabi sa helmet na to maybe let's go ahead and ride more uh, maybe 15 to 20 minutes let's try that and see what the helmet will give me okay so let's go Okay guys, so what's up? Uh, we're at the end of the helmet review, as you can see. <laughs> okay, so final thoughts on the helmet. It's a really good helmet. Uh, comfortable. I've ridden it just now for around 40 minutes to 1 hour. And okay siya. Comfortable siya. Hindi siya uh, mabigat na nangangayat yung leeg ko. And at the same time, maganda yung wind noise suppression niya at around 50 kilometers per hour. Yung significant uh, difference niya kumpara sa ibang helmet is eto. Ayan, as you can see, um, the helmet is sitting pretty well. Also, sasabihin ko sa inyo, uh, this helmet is being given away uh, on my channel. Uh, the link is in the description and it's in the screen right here. If you want to join that, uh, ask your friends to join. The helmet is free. Uh, there are certain rules that you need to follow before you get in the giveaway, okay? Dito na lang tayo. Until next time, I will see you guys on the next video. Bye!